Watson under the gun. He starts the hand with 1.9 million, currently third in chips. He folds. Vanessa Selps. That's pocket kings. As if Vanessa needed a big pocket pair to get aggressive. Vanessa raises to 50,000. Action folded to Vladimir Trinovsky. He'll pass from the small blind. Ace-8 for Olashemian in the big blind. Now, even though we know he's behind, defending your big blind with Ace-8 is totally fine against the min-raise. The chip leader does defend. We go to the flop, which is King-10-6. Top set for Vanessa. We three kings be stealing some gold. Shemian checks to the raiser. Vanessa checks behind. Shemian does have backdoor hearts. Not anymore. Full house now for Vanessa. It was pretty strange that Vanessa did not continue the flop. Well, that deception seems to have worked because Shemian will now lead the turn for 67,000. And he is drawing dead. Now, does she continue playing this slow? That looks like a raise. Vanessa makes it 208,000 total. I'd say for most players, checking back the flop and then raising the turn will look like a bluff. And this is a tough line for her to take for value unless she's got a 10. Shemian with just ace high will call. He's just floating here. I don't think he thinks he has the best hand very often. Deuce of diamonds on the river. He checks. I know that look. Don't worry, Miranda. This time she's actually got it. And I don't know if Ola was calling the turn to fold river on a total brick. So this could be real trouble for him. 543,000 in the pot. Vanessa bets 465,000. Shemian shoves. Oh. Vanessa calls and doubles up. Bizarrely, I don't hate Ola's play. If Vanessa's got anything but a house here, I think she's put in a really sick spot. Sometimes they have it. Nice hand. Thank you. A sick self-style play from Shemian. Gone wrong.